Hello everyone, welcome again in Engman YouTube channel. So in this video, we will continue our series on drilling a new well using T Navigator. Okay, we do reservoir simulation and this case is about drilling a new well and we will do this in T Navigator. So it's very, very useful, interesting and quite innovative reservoir simulation software. So in this previous video, we already exercised about adding a new production well and the name of the well is p dash p underscore one and in this video we will try to add a new injector okay so currently we are looking at the saturation of oil map from 3d three-dimensional perspective so i will go back to 2d all right and then we can move the time slider to the left to the original time and again we will use mobile in place okay so this is the location of our production well and we can look back to see the production rate oil production rate so so this is the flow rate and we can also check the pressure so the bottom hole pressure keeps decreasing okay until it reaches quite almost like pseudo steady state flow region flow regime i mean so let's add a new injector and let's say i want to put the new injector we can look at this size so 300 20 meters will be this long so let's say i want to put my new injector here maybe so what will happen and i will add the injector maybe here november 2009 Let's say if I put my new injector here, right click and add well, okay. But you can also do well addition by using here, this one, well actions, well creation settings, okay. Single injector, common settings. So look at this one, common settings. So I can add more than one injector and the setting will be common the setting will be the same with the setting that i will set up here okay so select this one single injector and set up okay so this is the the setup okay by default all the z layers vertical layers will be you know will be perforated will be opened and go to the control again the control will be based on the beta bottom hole pressure and it is 450 bars and the injection rate i want to cap at 500 standard meter cube per day no need for economic limits well, efficiency, I want to make it just one. All right, so it's quite easy. Click OK. And I want to add my well, my new injector. Okay, maybe in... Now I will use Alt left key. Okay, sorry. Yeah, let's make it this one. Okay. Yeah, I've done that actually. So to see the well, just move the time slider and here. So this is our well. This is my new injector. Okay, show all wells and well names. So you can look at my new injector in 3D view you see the location of my injector. So it's located down deep. Okay, 
lower than this production well. Okay. By the way, at this point of time, okay, before any calculation, you can still delete the well. 